Hello my friends, hello, welcome back to another Sunday stream. We're going to be playing more Lies of P today and I'm looking forward to that. Last time we managed to defeat this hulking brute called the V in the, uh, in the large exhibition, I believe. Uh, the exposition of it. And we got some more information about a certain alchemist who's up to no good. So we're diving in to see what else is going on there. We're currently in some kind of graveyard of puppets. Could be interesting. I'm expecting us to go and find uh, a raven or a crow or something similar, some kind of creature that uh, likes shiny things because we're looking for the gold ergo. Let's see if we can find it today. Shall we? See how things are proven through. Looks all right. Let's do this. Tiki tack. Yes, the Grand Exhibition. That's where we were. Had it gone according to plan, the newest would have demonstrated the technological prowess. Yes, this is where we were last time. So we got past a certain area. Benefit. Let's receive. What's this? You obtain the Azure Dragon Crescent Glaive, a bandana of the Honourable, and an armour of the Honourable. Um, well, there was a patch release, so I think that's probably where we got that. Uh, let's see, where is that? Oh, it's on the special weapons. What is this? A gigantic pole weapon from an eastern land. Its massive weight can be borne only by those who have undying loyalty. The hero wielded this weapon for his sworn brothers and the world. The dragon's oath engraved on the glaives has become legend passed down over a thousand years. Now, does this have something to do with uh, the combination that they currently have going with um, the souls like? That's a uh, Wukong, I think. That could be. Uh, and we find a new piece of armor so we could have a look at that and a bandana still not too sure about those might have a look at that later let's see I see some big fellas I thought we dealt with uh, of that sort already. I don't think we have to do that again. Yes, we do. Up into the future, what? Ooh, that one sounds lovely. The big guy is up in the future. So, Alright, can we get in? I don't think we can, not like this. So, two puppets of the future. Just great. I think we. I bought one of these before when I found it. Ooh, ooh, ooh. What the heck? I didn't realize we had lost that much health already. When in shock, stamina recovery immediately decreases. Ah, okay. And that's 15,000 ergo, so I would like to pick that up again. Watch.
Okay. Let's, okay. okay. Let's see if we can run past. There we go. Using that cannon against them. we can make our way to that. They've taken over the post. Beware of the rocks. Entry. The reed. Yeah. Oh, hello. Kiki. Oh. Not very nice. So this is obviously going to be a bunch of shortcuts over here. We can look at this. Yes, we can. Can we get on that thing? Yes, we can. There we go. Covered in goo. Fragments. Nothing too fancy just yet. So we have to watch it. Ah, he's too far off. Squish very nice. So there's a cave over here. Uh, let's deal with him first because there's a nice little box there. Yeah, I would rather not hit that. them hanging on the ledge here. Come on up. Thank you. Now what's in the box? What's in the box? It's the dog. <laughs> the Legion caliber. Very nice. We can upgrade our weapons on the Or our arm, I should say. What's over here? Anything? The cave it is then. Ah. Come on. Rolly, rolly, rolly. Get the thing. Get out of the way.
Ooh, advanced strength. Nice. How do we do this? Moonstone, great. Yeah. Oh, come on. Really? So, if you pick something up, apparently you can't run afterwards until you get rid of the the box. That's right. closer than I would have wanted. Got to pick that up earlier. Same with this one, apparently. Experiment. Report of order test subject 890. The most successful case from the prototype elixir injection experiments. Three patients suffering from the petrification disease who got the elixir injection at the same time died. Right up until their deaths, they experienced painful necrosis and skin rupture, seizures and convulsions, and crystalline metastasis throughout the body. Ultimately, they became mutations known as carcasses. Yes, I thought that would be it. Number 890 was able to suppress neutralization side effects and has been stable for 56 hours so far. Just the Disassociative amnesia, seizures, aggressive urges, and hallucinations found in typical petrification disease victims. Personal opinion. I confirm that the orders proposed to take a stalker with verified physical abilities as a sample is very effective. The sample extracted from number 890 is estimated to help the elixir development in the next step. Sister Adriana, who will receive the next baptism, is expected to be able to fulfill the Order's wishes. Wake up, evolve, ascend. We the Reborners will prepare for the birth of God. Yes, that was what the alchemist was thinking of doing. Oh! Yes, hello. I am not number 890. Name Precious. Ah! This must be quite an urgent patient to seek out my humble abode. Oh, you are still breathing. I must treat you quickly. Grant cannot have any more live patients. Wait, what? Trust me, it's better this way. It is far nobler to die as a human. Oh dear. And if you're not alive, then you must be dead. That's just logic. Stamina on the block. 
In my judgment as a doctor, all should end while they're still human. There we go. I expect to do more damage with that. In my judgment as a doctor, all should end while they're still humans. Okay. Adelina. We did get a nice owl mask there. Who is Adelina? Something tells me we need a different part there. Yes, this is the part. Okay, here we go again. Uh, quite a long way away, but I think we'll unlock a shortcut once we get past those boulders. And we don't have to fight the big guy anymore, so... There's that. Ooh, we definitely want to unlock this shortcut because there is something very nice behind there. How do we get there? There is a ladder over there. We may be... side of the barn. We jump from here. Is that the way to go? I don't think so. Nope. Very much no. Well, that's a waste of go. At least we don't have to worry about the Ergo anymore. It would be nice if we could at least get rid of that cannon there. Uh, from the other side. Oh, hello. you have for me? Fancy Vanini collection. Okay, I think Vanini will be very interested in that. I'll go this way, okay. Ah, let's wait for the corruption to die down a little bit before we continue. 11.6k just from walking there. Oh, it's probably from the Owl Doctor as well. Makes sense. 
Ooh. Hello. Excuse you. Must be a way for this to open. works was totally planned that way yes totally totally planned Let's unlock this first. Stargazer activated. Very nice. And we've got unlocked. Now let's see what's the item that's over here. The resistance ampoule. That's not too bad. Ooh. Yeah, the problem there is you need to run in order to be able to jump, but you can't run. In such a small ledge. But at least we're close enough that, yeah, that's it for us here. Okay, master go receive. Lovely. And here we go. Will you? Excellent. Well, at least I'm still enjoying this, so. Yes, it doesn't really matter that we die a few times now. It's still fun, I think. Hello. Um, please don't. Don't do that. It's very rude. To say the least. That counts. Thank you. Here. Kill that. Down. This is where timing becomes even more key. I'm sure we have a nice cool limestone. At least nice cool durability, I mean. There we go chuck there. Where do we go from here? Probably over there. Okay. Maybe we can go 
get our hands on that item. Okay. Now let's deal with the big guy. What else over here? Just a big guy? Just the big guy. A grenade, crystal moonstone, some star fragments, and the box. What's in the box? Arch disrupt new cartridge. Nice. What does that do? Disruption resistance. Okay. Uh, a lot less break resistance, though. Now, that's kind of weird. I think I still prefer the ladder. Drop cartridge. It is a lot lighter though. Ah, uh, didn't we have items that we were not equipping because of the weight? Mm. Like the reinforced leather? No, those are all the right weight. I mean, this is a nice item when it comes to weight. Gives a lot less protection, though, against shock. So we might be able to use that if we find something where we actually need it. When we need the, uh, the weight limit. I saw you. Hello. Whoa. Long spear that is a technique weapon. Interesting, very interesting handle. DB, though, whereas the one we're currently using is a CB. A spear blade fashioned in a hurry from a broken fence. The uniquely splayed spear blade is surprisingly effective. The long spear that the people made in haste was crude, but effective. The artist Bastian remarked that it was a work of art that represented the city of Krat. Uh, I guess so. Yeah, maybe. Like it a little bit. And the handle is made out of a signpost's support. The marks signifying the location are faded to the point that they are unrecognisable. Short on weapons, the citizens quickly started to make weapons out of city property. It was like a mini diorama of crap. So they're actually breaking down all of the land posts now just to make weapons. That's kind of cool. That's a very interesting concept. Um, maybe it would be interesting if someone made a game of that where you could 
uh, like demolish houses or whatever, turn those into weapons as well. I think that might be interesting. Be an interesting system. Hmm. Adelina was the prima donna, right? That was why. Okay, so she's here. We need to talk to Vanini because we have a nice little connection. At the house of Vanini, even. Strike a light. Yes. You found a commemorative coin dating from the founding of the Vanini Foundation. I did, yes. The yes, Foundation I is a sort of fan club, sir. Mm. A very limited number of these were minted for the original members. Didn't we find that early? Well, once so. Master Vanini established himself as the <clears throat> Prince of High Society, mm -hmm. his popularity skyrocketed, and his signature coat and glasses were mass produced. Uh -oh. This is one of the originals, however, from the limited run. Take care of it, won't you? Of course. You have restored Master Vanini's lost collection. I have. You've earned this small token of appreciation, sir. You are welcome. Very welcome, Martin. Sounds very nice. At he the really is the Tony Stark of this universe. That's hand over. Master Vanini's collection box. You are indeed full of surprises, sir. Yes. Patrons of Prestige I I... can always count on seeing a bit more than the average customer. Mm -hmm. I am talking about you, sir. Shall we pay a visit to the House of Vanini's private reserve? I would like that. At the House of Vanini. What is exactly in your private reserve? And Creator's max amount of HP, stamina, and legion. Could be very useful. Uh, increased damage on carcasses. So I guess this is the new one. Arch Space Armor Liner. Now uh, Arch Fiber. Yeah, sure, we'll get those. They're a little heavier, but it's not that problematic. Franks. Uh, let's see. Equipment. So we can now switch from Belford to. Ah. Just slightly heavy now. So we need. We can just get another point. I think that's probably best. The point I sense something strange. Oh. Something like the changes you're going through. The sort of thing you'd read in a fairy tale. Well, this is Go Pinocchio. Go to Geppetto's room. You should see it for yourself. But my... my Whatever portrait. choice you make. We'll have to have a look at that. Uh, there we go. 9,000 ergo for another level. So what exactly has changed with our portrait then? Because if that portrait is... mutating somehow... It... I guess... This is the actual Pinocchio, so my nose is growing because I've been lying. That is interesting. Ah, I'm glad you're here, my son. Have you seen that painting? I have. I can't believe my eyes. It's almost as if something is growing out of the portrait. Yeah, more than a little. I remember commissioning that piece from an artist named D. Gray. D. Gray? Like all D. Gray artists, man? he was eccentric. What a bet. He claimed <laughs> that a painting could harbor a living soul. Mm. But how can that happen? Just like the fairy tale. 
forgive a foolish man his ramblings. Perhaps the seed of its growth was there all along. I know you're curious, so see for yourself. It, it, it has quite the nose. Quite the nose. <laughs> Interesting. Ah. Let's head on back. Aboard the Baron Swamp Ravine. Oh, someone wants to talk to us. I get the puppets, but what is happening? I think it was her. Will you do um, me a favor? For once, it's Maybe. not difficult or dangerous. Just give this to Alidoro. Alidoro? I give it to him myself, but he's in the barren swamp now. Ah, the you will understand the significance of this gift. I know. Four fingered glove. I know my way around a weapon. I would, because we can upgrade. We have the Ergo. Okay. So I have to have a chat with Aladoro in a moment. I know my way around. We need one more half moonstone in order to get that up to a plus nine. Uh, let's see, Aladoro was, I think, here. Because that was just around the corner where we unlocked the shortcut. Go up here. This way. There he is. And you. You're a worthy hunter, and it is worthy prey. What's this? A gift for a rescuer. Mm -hmm. From a technician girl. Yes. Hmm, I don't remember. I've saved so many of the common people. Anyway, uh, thank her, I suppose. Oh. <laughs> oh dear. These gloves are a mess. They don't even fit. Is this a practical joke? <sighs> My god, I never did like that girl. She's just like him. Oh. <sighs> never mind. Who's him? I thought you had better taste than this. How disappointing. Get these rags out of my sight. You're a worthy hunter, and it... Hmm. So he won't take the rags. Maybe the him is the, uh, the smith that she... Works with. How could be? But she was originally working with someone, I think. We haven't seen that person. But... Let's chat about it. Hey, about my request last time. Mm -hmm. Did you give Ali Doro the gloves? We did. Yes, yeah. we did. Even the Union's advancement test didn't make me this nervous. <sighs> All right, I'm ready. Tell me the truth. Oh. Did the gloves okay. make Alidoro happy? Um. Oh, really? What? I his fingers are fine? Yeah. That can't be right. And no, I'm not being precious about my work. When the workshop tower collapsed, the hound lost a finger saving me. A different hound? Something to puzzle over. In any case, thanks for doing your part. You're welcome. You're very welcome. So a different hound. Did he perhaps defeat the hound some time ago? Puzzling.
Dazzling indeed. No lying. Let's do this. Go. We did upgrade our weapons, so very, very nice. Oh, hello. Whoa, that's a big boy. With a lot of help. Ow. Yep. Do it again. Ah, leaping anyway. Yeah, that makes sense, I guess. Hmm, looks like we can get to the cannon from here. Very nice. What did the leaping and do? Anything that can be equipped to a a puppet? Information and memories that are useful. Yes, yes, yes. The works craftsman with an interest in running and the puppet into the marathon. Obviously, the puppet did not win any medals. No, but it increases max stamina. We already used a life amulet. Maybe it's worth it to buy that amulet that increases all the three stats. And use that instead of the regular life amulet. You could be very sneaky. Those pitchforks are so dangerous. There we go. Thank you. Another nice little shock opened up. Now to deal with the cannon. That was one move. 
Thank you. And we get the rotation. a lot more than the previous one. It would be nice if we could clear out all of the corruption lying there. And ergo just from going there. Clearing out a few of them. That's not bad. Oh, I guess we also cleared out the cannon, so there's that. Pretty nice as well. Take it. No, thank you. Puppet of the future. Oh, there was nothing in there. you. It's a very nasty place to fight. The high tip. Oh, 
what? Oh yes, we are definitely killing the other one as well. If they drop quartz, that's so much worth it. <laughs> so much. So definitely. Uh, yeah. And a half moon stone, so we can upgrade this to a plus nine. Because of the shock, we are so low in stamina, mm -hmm. Richard. Another quartz, so definitely worth it. Ah, great. I think that might be enough to upgrade us to the next tier. Not entirely sure, though. Two and a half thousand ergo as well. Very nice. Very nice. We go. Oh, hello. I didn't think you would respawn. Yes, you did. Yeah. Doesn't matter. Still dies. Still dies very quickly. Sneaky ambushes here. Just a lot of dead puppet park. Whoa! An earthquake! No, probably that a came from the direction bird. of Krat Central Station. Oh, this could be bad, pal. Really, really bad. The direction of Central Station? That would be bad. They're on our way out. Ooh. Hmm. 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 Oh. <sighs> there must be some way to Important things first. Yep. Don't want to have to walk the entire end again. Uh, hey, are you a treasure hunter too? 
Yeah, time. Strange to meet someone in my line of work. I know how this looks, but I'm not a thief or anything. <laughs> I am on a serious expedition. If you're serious, you wouldn't then happen what's to know with a, a treasure hunter named Alidoro, would you? I'm a uh, big fan. I plan my expeditions to follow Alidoro's traces, ah. but ugh, this lock has me at a dead end, and I so wanted to explore the Hermit's Cave. Oh, all I can do is keep plugging away. If you come back by, say hello. Maybe I'll get this place open. I might. I might indeed. I think you do. Maybe Alidoro comes by and we'll open it for you. It'd be nice as well. Uh, teleport to the hotel. Why does it still show us as being able to talk to her? I thought we already cleared that. Maybe she has more to say about the hound. That would be interesting. Not to mention we can upgrade to a plus one right now. You have a moment to talk about Alidoro? She does have more to say. I know I sound obsessed, but when the workshop tower collapsed, he saved me. Hmm. We could have starved to death trapped under the rubble. If it wasn't for Alidoro's sacrifice back then, I don't want to think about it. And yet I can't forget it. That's why it's so puzzling. It's not like his finger could grow back. Yeah, so it's obviously could someone else. find out more about Alidoro for me? If I called it surveillance, would that be too cruel? Nah. In any case, we need to watch out. You be careful too. Will do. We'll I know do. my way around a well. Yes, I would like you to turn this into a cluster. Thank you. So now we need a full moonstone in order to get that plus, plus ten. And we have another weapon. At the house of Anini. Also have enough to buy... where is it? This one. The Blue Guardianship Millet. Uh, let's see. The girl from the Monad family felt the puppet's pain and it made her sad. She made a special amulet to help the dying puppet recover. Thank you. And let's equip that instead of the life. A little bit heavier. It upgrades all three stats and not just life. That's, that's pretty good. Um, Whatever choice you make, Upgrade quite a bit. Um, vitality is pretty nice. More stamina is nice. Capacity would be nice, but maybe, maybe we'll just add some more technique. Just getting that damage output up is very, very useful. Especially if that means that we can kill things in two hits rather than three. Just helps with just the flow of battle. That we have two quarts to use on phase four. That means we can buy this. Now what are our phase four options? Enhanced weapon attack. There was natural recovery. Okay, and reduces. Let's do the lower as natural recovery because that means that they can't recover as much natural HP. That and the survival types probably a good idea as well. So the guard regain recovery is nice. Resistance. Oh, increases maximum number of pulse cell users. Easy choice. So we need one more, I guess, for the additional amulet. Slot. Yeah. So one more quartz to find. Didn't suppose he has. No one. matter what, fate serving her welcome. Impress. 
send? No, he doesn't. He has a Legion Caliber though, for upgrading the weapon. We might upgrade our puppet strength. Also now uh, attack. Pull a wire trace on enemy and press and hold it, it will trigger a link attack. Yes, please. Achievement unlocked. Strongest Legion Arm. Modify a Legion Arm to its max level. Thank you very much. Right, the bridge. The bridge of the Barons. Trees, no. It's stained with green sap. Why in the world is that thing even here in Krat? I thought they were joking when the city dispatched me to catch the monster. I figured it was probably a broken puppet or a bear with the petrification disease. That green thing is huge. What on earth did it eat in the swamp to grow so big? I don't think it's the waste problem. I've observed it. It obsessively protects its nest and likes to bring its toys there. The puppet bodies aren't just used as toys. This thing sucks ergo from scrapped puppets for playing with what's left. It feeds on ergo and that's why it grows so big. This whole area is a feast for it. I need to report this. Blasted bastard, screw you all. I think that green guy was made by the alchemist for Oh, he's there, mistake. How else can they ignore our backup requests like this? They're always like this. If something is unfavorable, they just ignore it. Why did they send us? Are we prey, not hunters? That guy is watching us more and more. He definitely knows we're here. He's looking at us like we're toys. God post captured Sue. Lost control of Ballista. Impossible to take back. I asked for forgiveness for all the sins of my life. The angel will guide us. That sounds like... I think will be the bird. Yes, it is boss time. Let's do this. That's a tiny area for a... That's not a bird. That is... What is that? That's a scary poison monster. The heck? Green monster of the swamp, yeah. It's a swamp monster, all right. It does decay. Well, at least we can get a hit in. Oh dear. I think he 
doesn't like fuck. I was a green monster at the swamp, I would be fine. Quite a few moves there, so we've got the regular hits. We should be able to parry those. We timed them right. Um, then there is the the bull rush. It does. I think we just gotta make sure that we're not too close when he does that. rough, he's wild. Yeah, yeah, I'm, I'm aware. I'm aware of what Decay does. Um, which also means... No, this is for damage reduction on those. Suppose we have a nice little acid resistance here. We do. That will lower quite a few other resistances as well. But a bit more acid resistance is not going to hurt us, I think. learn his
just too late. Does seem like a very quick fight, so maybe there's a second phase coming through as well. Do this. the same telegraph as his uh, poison spewing. new. Getting close to First phase. Okay. It's it's 
eating the ergo? It's fusing with the puppet. I was afraid there was going to be a second phase. We're out of blasts. Really? If it, it, it's going to ram through me without being red. Okay. Okay, okay sure. Okay, so we need to make sure that we get through the first stage without too much of a pitch. That's going to be difficult. And then we need to learn a whole new set of moves on the second phase, so... Great! Just great. Seven. It's very similar to Bloodborne Dark Souls in how they handled that situation. They just allow you to be stuck. Whereas if it was closer to Sekiro, you had the ability you had far more mobility so you could just jump over.
worth it. That's the nasty. One. Oh, and the rain jump. Second phase. In this we have a fast. Still not inside. Sure, he does so much durability damage. So let's use a star fragment. Thank you.
needed one more hit one more hit ah. but this is definitely the way to go in that was Second phase. That grows more health than last time.
Goodbye. Not a devouring green hunter. I knew you'd do it! Finally, the last hero weapon is in my hands. What? Nasty, nasty, nasty. Ah, uh, let's talk to us. I knew you'd do it. I had a feeling you'd be the perfect bait. Bait? What? I got what I wanted thanks to you. The last hero weapon is finally in my hands. The I knew where it was, be. but I didn't dare lay my hands on it. The swamp is too dangerous. Someday soon, you'll see. Hmm. You have my thanks. And you've earned a nickname. Alidoro's best bait. Oi. See you at the hotel. I'm not your bait. Right, so we have the golden ergo. Excellent. That should allow us to get to the Alchemist's Island, I think. I believe that's what Veningi had to say about that. No, I saw that we could talk to her. Come here, child. This is my first chance to get a proper look at you. She looks healed. It's a shame my illness kept me from seeing such a handsome gentleman. Oh, oh to be young again. Mm-hmm. You are responsible for this miracle. You have no idea how much it means to me. I have to stay seated as I feel a little lightheaded, but I feel the vigor I thought I'd lost forever. Thank you. If Krat ever holds a proper ball again, I hope you'll ask me for a dance. Is that her quest line? Completed? Is that it? Okay, greetings. Rid of Ergo. The Ergo. The Whispering. People have no idea, so thanks for keeping me company. So. We could play the piano. Same song that we just played. I think it is. Yeah, it looks like it. But it feels unfinished. Like, there's more, more to be played. You made the right choice. Lady Antonia is completely cured. Mm -hmm. She is so happy. I don't even know how to thank you. I don't know now what a glorious yes, a feeling it is nice. to wish for the happiness of someone you care for. Mm. Perhaps it's presumptuous for a puppet to call that feeling love. I am happy enough just to protect her as best I can. Thank you for saving her and for guiding me through this emotion. You are very well. No matter what fate brings us, serving her welcome to... Uh, who else? We had to talk to Benigni. No! Can it be? It can! Are you hurt anywhere? Ha! You never fail to surprise me, Companio. Mm -hmm. 
Now, allow me to return the surprise. This little wonder creates a lead acid battery in a flash. Oh. The golden ergo is the purest form of power we can use, and it's nearly perfect. We could power a city block with this. Useful? You see, the alchemists ordered transportation from me, powered by this. I'm not sure, but maybe it's still in their underground base. Just one problem with the base. I don't know exactly where it is. I don't know in exactly either. I had to just hand it over immediately after the launching ceremony. Well, the Golden Ergo has to be after close all, to it. I am the prince of the Krat social scene, and I surrendered to their mysticism. There. It's done. Now take it. Thank you, Vernini. Uh, a secret alchemist's underground lair. That sounds like something Antonia might well have heard of. You'd better ask her about it. Ooh. Golden lead acid battery. I know my way around a weapon. Okay, I know my way around a weapon. I'm upgraded to an A technique. Let's do that. There we go. Even stronger. We need more technique cracks though. By the way, do you remember when I mentioned my partner? Mm -hmm. I got a distress signal from him. Is that so? His last location was Krat Central Station. But my gear won't protect me from the petrification disease there. Yeah, that is where the Can you find him came. for me? I'll make Thanks. My partner's name is Atkinson. I think he was trying to secure an escape route. Yeah, we'll head to Krat Central Station in a moment. Whatever choice you make. Again. So Antonia should have information. Yes. I heard what happened at the exhibition. Yes. How frightful. It's no wonder you're trying to track down the alchemists. I'll tell you one thing. Many secrets are buried in the city of Krad. Mm -hmm. The same goes for this hotel. Beneath us, oh. there is a passage connected to an underground base of the alchemists. It's where Ergo's vein was first discovered. Is that so? Long ago. Until the petrification disease, the hotel worked hand in hand with the alchemists. But I didn't know they'd be so corrupt. Everything changed when Simon became their leader. And the Fire Nation attack. Oh, I thought the survivors of the exhibition would be different. But they're just as corrupt. <laughs> the passageways to the underground base are locked from their side. We can't get through unless they open them. And the underground base is the only way to embark for the Isle of Alchemist. If we find the right alchemist, perhaps we can get that door opened. I heard that some of them occupy the collapsed tower of the train station. Oh, of course. And the collapse makes me wonder whether they had something to do with the recent earthquake. Look into it, won't you? Of course. I was planning to anyway. Totally fine. Uh, right, he should be back here. Let's see what we can get for the newest. I found the last treasure thanks to you. The saber. A precious artifact from overseas. Is that so? It'll always remind me of the rascal who stole it, then fell into the nest. I, I tried to save him, but uh, I failed. Let the punishment fit the crime, I say. <laughs> and in a twist of fate, you must become the weapon's true owner. A great weapon calls for a great warrior. Two dragons sword. That's a technique weapon. Precious sword that was at the Grand Exhibition Gallery. They say it was the saber of a commander from Quiet Eastern Land. But Steve remembers the vow of the warrior. The general who rose up with the dragon to protect the people claimed a lonely victim. 
the dozens of wolves. The A. Interesting weapon has Link Emergency Dodge. Dodge quickly forward. Okay. And Wind of Swords. Blow a Wind of Swords. Deals a redatch. And the alternate is Fury Attack Dodge. The sentries feared the ghostly movement of the green monster of the swamp. The sentries miraculously managed to put the monster's information in an amulet, but he also disappeared. Ooh. Does sound like a nice weapon. Lower on physical attack, though. Low fable charge as well. Hmm. Let's buy it. Not sure if we'll use it, but I think we'd buy it at least. Yeah, we have to go to Central Station, I get that. We can't use this way, but... I also feel like there's more to find there in the nest. There was a little area behind it. And I want to see if the Treasure Hunter managed to open up the... Uh, the gate. Let's do that first. Rocky night. Life is short, and life... All I can do is keep plugging away. Yeah. You never heard of Alidoro? Mm -hmm. He's a treasure hunter and one of the best. And unlike a lot of the riffraff in Krat, he's not a thief. He's a pro who excavates antiquities methodically. And professionalism is important when you're talking about Ergo. Right. Just mention Ergo, and everyone cares about the history behind the ruins. <laughs> That's why Alidoro has the reputation he does. The quality of his information and the condition of the antiquities are on another level. I know there are rumors about Alidoro lately, but I know jealousy when I hear it. Yeah, but he's not the same person as he used to be. The rumors? <laughs> well, for starters, they're nonsense. Alidoro is the last person you'd suspect of crimes like fraud and theft mm. and assault. It's crazy. I've even seen a wanted poster of him. Those alchemists must be behind it. Those guys act like they own the ruins and they don't want treasure hunters to earn an honest living. I mean, come on. We're talking about the Alidoro who saved all those lives in the workshop tower rubble. So, no. I don't believe a word of it. Well, the workshop tower is at Central Station. Would you get Station. a load of this? I grabbed it as a souvenir, but it's just malicious propaganda. Look at that. You take it. Thank you. Wanted. Aladu. A con man who calls himself a treasure hunter. Wears a hound mask. Charged with fraud, impersonation, theft, assault, and other serious crimes. He's very good at tricking people. So watch out. Sounds like something we want to talk to him about. Uh, let's see what's behind the nest books. Still can't believe it wasn't a large bird. I thought it would definitely be that. Oh, 
much crow. So this is his nest. Definitely some things to find here. The enemies are quite a bit tougher than before. Be an optional function. a big enemy figured he'd at least drop something. The ground bunker. Ooh. of the petrification disease or something. Is this actually the way to Central Station? It might be. Got some decay going. Looks like that might actually be the way to Central Station. I thought we would have to take the uh, the normal route. Yep, the station. We're dead, all right. Those are. Twenty-three train ticket to San Marian. The text is hard to read because of the blood stain. Boom. 
So this is going to become a shortcut. wasn't there before. We need to find a way to clear the mist from there, I guess. Because that doesn't seem healthy. to be an ostrich and things started popping up from the, from the ground. Weird. Oh, there is one. getting infected puppets because of course we are. Just having normal infected humans wasn't bad enough. other side. That's pretty interesting. Let's see, so the things over there... Grinds away the
respawn momentarily. Stuck in an animation. Quartz. Quartz. That's exactly what we needed. So that means that we can now get that extra amulet slot. So nice. Uh, let's make sure to get our flasks back first. Da, 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 da. Oh, right. No. Is a cool one. Okay, the big gun. We've got another one of those annoying big guys. Okay, I think K. Is that? What is such a large tentacle that it comes up? All the way over there. So we can go this way. We can go this way. Let's see what's over here first. So I know I said before that a certain area was Blighttown, but I guess this actually is Blighttown. That's a big guy. With What's the next one. Steal the weapons. Is this the way we were going? 
that is our train. It's blocking the way to our train. That is crystallized. a location where he's not covered in crystal. I cracked away his grid his crystal sword. There we go. Murderer puppets amulet. What's that then? Increases damage inflicted on humans. Okay, the joy of having killed a human lies dormant within the clockwork heart. I will kill. I will kill anything that resembles a human. That's a bit much. That way, we go this way. This is our train. That's obviously the way we have to go. So we're going to check the side area first. Because that's how we roll. Not to mention this will unlock a nice shortcut for us. Seventeen thousand ergo. Hello. Time to head back. Uh. Can Whatever choice you make. Multiple things, if I'm correct. So let's get a little bit of capacity because we'll need it. Because by using the quartz, we can unlock that next amulet slot. Finally, get some more. Lovely things in there. Okay, so the third slot is going to be. Charge Legion when limited to an enemy is interesting. Very nice. Uh, really lowers Legion consumption. Answers Fable charging. They call them fatal attacks, not. No, it's obviously going to be the charge legion and the limitating enemy, because that's going to give us the ability to use our legion armor. So many good abilities here.
we doing here? Still the same? So, fourth amulet slot. Arm of Gore temporarily increases physical damage upon successful attack. Is nice, but you need a lot of weight there. Enables dodging with low stamina is pretty useful as well, but again, very heavy. Uh, increases resistance of things. Now let's just build up our Ergo acquisition for a bit. Collecting Ergo quite quick already now. It might be nice to get some more levels in because we're at a point where we can really, really see the Ergo stack up. It'll be quick. Yeah, you don't look too good. The suburbs are sealed off. There's no escape. Yeah. Communications cut off too. Yeah. Someone planned this all out. No idea who. But my pay grade. Well, I'm thinking the alchemists. If you meet someone named Bell in the city, tell her. Atkinson died. A soldier. Oh, well. Don't worry. Atkinson's letter. My dearest Belle, I remember the day I met you through your father's friend, Sir Loped. That day, the steam of Krat Central Station was thick on the platform, and a flock of birds was flying overhead above the glass ceiling. There, I was watching for you. When I saw a lady take one step down those stairs, I knew it was you. Your pleasant laughter left some impression on me. The reason I'm writing this letter. Yes, I am at the train station. It reminds me of you from that time. We were colleagues at first and then lovers, but I still can't let you go. The way you smiled and looked forward to the exhibition and festivals. Those beautiful nights with the fireworks. I just can't let it go. So if we are to survive and make it out of here, I plan to visit you with this letter. Please stay safe and wait for me until then. Sincerely. Goodbye, Atkinson. We'll let them know. something good. Master Chef's knife. I can't. Sure. Deep. 
B weapon. Uh, it's short, but good enough to slaughter pup. The citizens who fought back during the pup frenzy the most were cooks. Their knives that were once used to prepare feasts were repurposed for slaughter to slaughter puppets. Uh, some famous chefs engraved their handles with their symbol or initials. While slaughtering puppets, they lost their sanity amidst the violence. They got more and more drunk on the feeling of cutting something to pieces rather than saving people. Yeah. I know there was a collapse, but why did they have to cut off communication? Please let us out. Where we were before. Ow. Ow. All right, they drain over. Oi. Very rude. Giving me back my ergo. Even worse. Yeah. Looks like a arena of sorts. Let's head back to Bell first. Here's a right to know. So we've got two ways to go on. One is inside of our train. And the other is going on where we were. Good to see now. you. I was getting worried waiting this long. Soldiers like me are blunt. Is is my partner safe? No. But let's say he was killed in action. This. This is Atkinson's handwriting on the letter. When we came to Krop, I never thought it would end like this. Sometimes you meet people who make you believe they'll always be with you, but a life can be snuffed out at any moment. Especially here. I need to stay alive to notify others of his death. Mm -hmm. But it feels like something inside me has died as well. Anyway, I appreciate knowing what happened. I mean it. Why? Got some new records here. So we've got why. This way. Let's head in our car. No, it feels like that might be the way on.
<clears throat> I've perfected the greatest pup. Man, a child. Really? Nothing else? I thought for sure there'd be something here. Guess I was speaker. Fine. Up the guy. Okay. Right. You lost, little lamb. Hand over all you've got. Robert. have it there. It wasn't that hard. We got stuck in this. Probably the, the main issue. Wanted to get out of the way first before using the cell, but then we got stuck on the wall. And that killed us. The strong rule, not the one. Yeah. 
he's striking harder. In a city where everything is upside down, the strong rule not the lie. Attacking me is quite wrong. Oh, we have definitely been here before, so we fought the big guy down there all the way at the beginning. the game there as well Thank you for dying okay we're out of cells That fights back. Nebulized alchemical boosts. I'm not sure what those are for. That does. Ah. Dark Moon Moonstone of the Covenant, hello. Very nice. Ah, Stargazer. Just what we needed. Definitely something here. So this looks like yes, Trinity. What do you have for me then? Remember the metal angel. We are simply on a journey. It follows his footsteps. Song of the day. The pickpocket who was overconfident in a gamble had his heart stolen and died. Workshop Master's Worker and a Carrier's Amulet plus one. So that's just a better version of that one. FP. Uh, so, Robber Weasels we have. Workshop Master's. Not that great, I think. Yeah, we're not going with the honourable one. I think the atoned is better. The honourable one is very much a Wukong. Yeah. Doesn't look great. Nope. Yeah. Not the best uh, of looks for him.
Well then. That does not look good. Let's see, big guy, small guy. I don't suppose there's anything to find over here before we go there. Locked. It's all locked. Okay. These puppets that were lying here before have now been all crushed, really corrupted. Destroy him immediately. Ish. Okay, box. Coil Mjolnir. That's a hammer. BD. So definitely a strength weapon. Large blunt. A hammerhead modified by attaching Vanini's storage pack. Logo functions as a conductor so that a strong electric shock causes it to release a current. I don't know whether Vanini is a genius or a fool for using an item like this as a mere storage battery. The opinion of a technician named Descartes. Vanini's storage battery because of course it has to be Descartes. The handle of a hammer altered by attaching Vanini's store. It was made long and sturdy so that it could withstand the hammer's impact. To use my storage battery in this horrifying thing. Descartes, the fool, genius. The opinion of Fanini on Descartes. And so, they both don't like this. I guess it was Descartes that created that weapon. But he also didn't like the fact that it was used as a storage battery, whatever he invented. Exhibition as well. The, uh, the bunch of shops before that. A few items. Ooh, they hit hard. 
Mark that. a new arm with that. Just what we needed, Stargazers. Thank you very much. Right, I think this is a good place to end it for today. We're going to be going through this further probably next week and I'm thinking we'll probably do that on a Friday because I've got some things to do that weekend. So stay tuned for that. I hope you had fun coming along with me for the ride. We've got a lot of stuff to do next time. See you there. Take care, you guys.